pulmonary compliance is a measure of the lung's ability to stretch and expand. In clinical practice it is separated into two different measurements, static compliance and dynamic compliance. Static lung compliance is the change in volume for any given applied pressure. Dynamic lung compliance is the compliance of the lung at any given time during actual movement of air. Low compliance indicates a stiff lung and can be thought of as a thick balloon, this is the case often seen in fibrosis. High compliance indicates a pliable lung and can be thought of as a grocery bag, this is the case often seen in emphysema. Compliance is highest at moderate lung volumes, and much lower at volumes which are very low or very high. The compliance of the lungs demonstrate hysteresis. That is, the compliance is different on inspiration and expiration for identical volumes. Calculation Pulmonary compliance is calculated using the following equation, where IV is the change in volume, and IP is the change in pleural pressure. For example, if a patient inhales 500 milliliters of air from a spirometer with an intrapleural pressure before inspiration of a euro 5 centimeters H2O and minus 10 centimeters H2O at the end of inspiration, then equals static compliance equals static compliance represents pulmonary compliance during periods without gas flow, such as during an inspiratory pause. It can be calculated with the formula where PPLAT equals plateau pressure. PPLAT is measured at the end of inhalation and prior to exhalation using an inspiratory hold maneuver. During this maneuver, air flow is transiently discontinued, which eliminates the effects of airway resistance. PPLAT is never PIP and is typically